Hi there, my name is Lawrence Tyndall here at Glidefast Consulting, and in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to add a new category to the category field on the incident form. Adding new categories to your incident form is extremely beneficial, as it allows you and your users to further categorize incidents as they come in. In today's tutorial, we're going to add a new category for SaaS, so when incidents that involve SaaS software come in, members of the service desk are able to select SaaS as the category. To get started, open up ServiceNow and in the navigation filter, type in Incidents and click on the Incidents module located underneath the service desk application. You'll now be navigated to the Incident List view. Open up any incident record so we can explore the form. Now that the incident form is loaded, right click on the category field label and select show choice list from the context menu. You'll now be navigated to the sys choice list table which contains all category choices across the system. We're going to click on show matching on the incident table value so we can see all incident category choices. As you can see we have five choices for incidents which include inquiry, software, hardware, network and database. To create a new choice, click on the New button. You'll be navigated to a blank choice form. To enter a new choice for SAS, we're going to enter SAS in the Label and Value fields, and then in the Sequence field, we're going to enter 6, since this is the sixth choice value for the incident form. Now click on the Submit button to create the new choice. Now if we navigate to the incident form and click on the Category field, you'll see that we have a new category choice for SAS. And it's as simple as that. Creating new categories in ServiceNow takes a few minutes, and it can help define your incidents much better. And that is all for this tutorial on how to add a new category to the incident form in ServiceNow.